I'm Tracy from Ark Animal Centre. We are Puppy Rescue, Rehabilitation and Rehoming Centre. We specialise in puppies and pregnant moms. We started this as a family, I don't know, idea I guess you could say. It's my mum, my sister and myself. We've been operating for about three and a half years and weekly you can see the difference that we, we do. At this stage, we are homing about 80, 90 puppies a month. We obviously get in a lot more than that. So we're always sitting with about between 60 and 80 puppies. We do have the two pigs. They're just our pets. Um, they're not going anywhere. <laughs> If people want to get involved and help the shelter, which is one of the questions we get asked, there's various ways, you know, people can either take it upon themselves to do a fundraising campaign or do a raffle or, you know, do, go do a food collection, anything like that, you know, if you have a bit of entrepreneurialism in yourself and you think, okay, you want to get involved, this is how you're going to help, we are so open to any new ideas, we must just bring it, you know. Another thing that we do a lot of is we do community service. All the kids need to do community hours in school. So they come through here during school holidays and then on weekends and they help around the shelter and they take the dogs for walks and they wash the dogs and it's, it's so good for the kids because a lot of these kids are getting out and they're actually experiencing the outdoors and they're learning about dogs. We do need volunteers. We don't have the funds to actually do this ourselves. So without the volunteers, there's no ways that we could do this. We rely on adult volunteers, especially people during the week that can come in and they can actually help with that administration. Reference checks or phone or, you know, just spend time with our dogs, especially the older ones or the puppies that need a little bit more TLC. Just socialising. People can come in for an hour and just come and play with the puppies. That's what we're looking for. Time is one of the biggest things people can give to a welfare. And if they really want to get involved, more, we've got plenty to do. They can get a My Planner card. It's part of the Woolworths My School, My Planet, My Village program that they run. That is very, very, very good for us. Um, at the moment, I think we've got about 300 or maybe just over people who support us. And it's such a small thing. It doesn't cost them anything. All they do is have to carry a card around and it helps us tremendously. I think we, the last amount we got was over 2,000 Rand. We also have an SMS line. Our community students, they go and distribute our posters. They'll send one or two SMSs a month and that's their way of helping us as well as coming here to volunteer. People ask me why I do what I do, like, you know, isn't it hard, isn't, don't you get sad, you know, don't you want a real job? And I say to people, you know, if, you, if you've seen a cause and a problem and you have the opportunity and you're in the position to make a difference, like why wouldn't you? Like why would you leave it to go be a normal person who works in a job and doesn't get covered with pool vomit every day? I mean, that's so boring. <laughs> I didn't plan to do this. I got involved in this through my younger daughter. And I think once you get involved with rescue, you either love it or you hate it. I happen to love it and I got involved full time. Once you're in it, you can't get out of it because you see how much there is and how much is needed out there that you can never walk away. There's a lot of heartache, but when you find that perfect home for that perfect puppy that you know wasn't going to make it, that's what makes the difference. Yeah, we're quite an expressive bunch, spirit fingers. This is what we do. Spirit fingers. <laughs> Save animals' lives. <laughs>